Hello everyone. Um, I apologize ahead of time how I sound. Uh, I get a little bit of a cold. Um, but I'm just going to run through a quick uh, tutorial on how to install the RAW function on your Canon T2i. Um, up to this point, what you should have done was download and install the firmware for the, uh, the most stable version of it. So you would just go to this website, the Magic Lantern, uh, FM, the download um, area, obviously. And the most recent build, the most stable, uh, the current stable release is the version 2.3, which is really stable, to be honest with you. I, uh, I've taken it off and put it back on my camera a couple times. I know there's some precautions out there, you know, that they're telling you just be careful because you really are. Um, it's, you know, you're putting the firmware on the card, which is adjusting things on your camera. Um, but, again, it's it's mostly on the camera. Uh, sorry, it's mostly on the card. Um, so, it's, it's really stable, in my opinion. I wouldn't be too concerned about doing it. Um, there's tons of tutorials online on how to do it. Um, Dave Dugdale just did one. Um, Luke Newman, if anyone's... Uh, I'm sure you guys are familiar with them. Um, so go ahead and, and if you already have this installed, what you should do now is go over to the forum. And now there's actually a category for raw video. Um, once you pull that up, there's actually a listing right at the top there actually. And I already have that pulled up in another tab. Now post number 262 right here what all you really have to do is go ahead and click on this and download it which I've also already done so let me go ahead and minimize my window here you get to see my lovely desktop uh, I'm going to pop in my card I already took my card uh, out of the camera popped it in my card reader so it's right here let me go ahead and open that then I'm going to obviously extract all the files to my desktop here. And there's, a mul there's multiple ways to do this. Right, let me go ahead and open this one too. I've seen mention on the forums about formatting the card a certain way and using different programs to, to do it. Um, really all I've been doing and it's been working out great for me is it's basically this I'm gonna take this what's in here now this is the most current stable release and what I had done was I took this folder dragged it to my desktop and if you could see over here magic lantern stable so I already have a version because what I'll end up doing is dragging the folders over along with the auto exec and replacing what's on the right hand side of your screen which is what is on the card and then when I want to go back to normal, I'll do exactly the opposite. So let me go ahead and close that out. And for the auto exec dot bin, I literally just drag that over, copy and replace. The Magic Lantern one, you could do the same exact thing. It's going to ask you if you want to merge the folders and overwrite the files, which you could. I literally just delete it again because I have the backup already on my desktop so if I ever want to pop it back on I can so I'm gonna take this folder drag it over here which as you see is still leaving it in the unzipped file on the left and also placing it in on the card so that's basically it guys um, you don't have to reload the firmware because it's already been loaded with the stable release so you're literally just popping this card back into your camera and the function should already be there with this release truthfully I haven't played with this one yet um, but if anything if you see one in the forum and it mentions about a module if you go all the way to the right and you see the letter M that's where you're gonna load the module um, and that's where a lot of people are getting confused with the ones that have been out there recently. Let me pull up the uh, yeah MK11174. Lately, the module's already been included with the uh, the download, so you really don't have to do anything. 
Uh, but that's it. I just wanted to run through quick. I, I see a lot of uh, comments on the forum. Uh, a couple of people are getting confused about what you have to do or how you go about doing it. Uh, and again, it's, there's other ways to do it. Uh, if anyone sees anything that I might be doing wrong, you know, you can let me know. You can leave a comment. Uh, but that's about it. That's really all you have to do. I've had success with it, and uh, it's getting uh, it's getting better and better. The uh, resolution has been getting larger. So, anyway, uh, again, as always, thanks for watching, and see you soon.